actual fuck. He's dead. Hello guys, welcome to a new Kicking Mustang gameplay video. I'm at a Milsim in the south of England at a British Army training facility. Uh, we start at our HQ here and we have intel that enemy forces are moving to capture three valuable buildings. My mission is pretty simple. I've been instructed to move forward and get in amongst them to prevent their free movement through the forest. This gameplay is a little bit different because unfortunately it is uh, scarred by quite a few cheats on the field and I'm going to be running a competition this game uh, for your chance to win a ghillie suit and crafting materials which have uh, both been donated by Skirm Shop in Holland. All you have to do is count up the number of cheats that you spot. Uh, put your answer in the comments below and the uh, people who get the correct answer, I will put them in the hat and draw the winner. Um, guys, thanks very much for watching and good luck in the competition. What you may be able to hear there is that um, I have a friendly squad who are uh, digging in on the crossroads and um, I, I can hear enemy forces moving through the forest. Uh, it's a pretty dense forest so I can't see them so I decide to make hide in this bramble bush in an effort to ambush any enemies who try to flank around the back of uh, my, my teammates as they defend the crossroads. Oh, did that miss you? Yeah, you got me good. No, nah, him. Did I miss you? Yeah, you hit me. Fucking hell. <laughs> mate, I love that suit. How the hell did that miss? I love that, mate. How the I fuck did that, that miss? Well, I'm back at my HQ and I'm resyncing my cameras and reloading my ammo and prepare to head back into the forest. Best, dude. What I did not realise at this point was that the enemy forces had overrun the crossroads and had moved up the road and are within very close range of our headquarters only a couple hundred meters away and i'm about to walk straight into a hornet's nest
behind me now I can hear movement and my spider sense is tingling and I'm pretty sure they're the enemy so I trust in the power of my leaf suit and go to ground uh, blending into the fry's floor and attempt to ambush them. Oh, hit! Whoa, hit! I hit you first time, dude. Fucking hell. Not far away. Maybe 150 metres, 200 metres they were from here. Yeah. We're back at HQ again. Uh, I rally friendly troops and we regroup as uh, we make a move to recapture those key buildings that the enemy forces are now occupying. That's the VIP, that's the HVT. Is that the HVT? Yeah. We have a bonus mission this Walking day, backwards. and that is to capture a high value target, the enemy commander. Could be a trap. Uh, but it's just too easy, and I suspect a trap, and so That's do my teammates, so we decide not to pursue. My hunch is right. I spot enemy forces setting up in an ambush position, and uh, this gives us the edge we need to engage them. And we formulate a plan. My teammates are going to lay down suppressing fire with their automatic weapons and also uh, send explosives onto the enemy positions, which will buy just enough time uh, and distract the enemy enough for me to be able to deploy my Silverback SRS sniper rifle and uses accurate fire to take out the dug-in defenders. Right, there he is. Yeah, just to the left of the tree. Got him. <laughs> With the building now clear and the crossroads uh, free of enemy forces, my squad and I push on into the forest as we try to secure the next high value building located here. the enemy forces seemingly a little bit confused there about where they are being shot from. They fall back and we think they are setting up defensive positions around one of the buildings. We decide to pursue and begin scouting the installations that we uh, need to capture to win this game. Careful in that sunlight mate. Careful in that sunlight. A shot just whizzed over your heads. Did you hear it? Like 
Well, with no way the through the back there, it's just impenetrable. We decide we're going to go around and my squad want to mount a frontal assault on the building. I decide to try to find a hide position and provide sniper support. Before I'm able to get into position, my team breach and find themselves facing resistance and they are quickly uh, forced back and uh, wiped out, leaving me alone in my hide, surrounded once again by enemy troops. Alone here, I decide that I'm not going to achieve much. I'm certainly not going to be able to capture the building alone. So I slip away through the ferns and make my escape, leaving the enemy guessing as to whether I'm still there or whether I have escaped. Um, I regroup with friendly forces and we decide to uh, attack another building. They're all worth the same amount of points, so uh, this fresh approach could potentially bad guys over here. win us the day. It seems my teammates are having an argument amongst themselves. I think they're arguing about a friendly fire incident earlier. This um, gives their position away in the enemy. Uh, attack. Thankfully, I noticed the enemy moving in.
sense a, a gap in the enemy lines here and I take it and uh, use the opportunity to slip away leaving the enemy unsure whether I'm still operating in the area setting up a new high position not too far away maybe a hundred meters from my original position players who I just ambushed at close range with my Mark 23 pistol. I've got a hunch that they're going to be coming back looking for me and although I'm often accused of being lucky uh, it does seem that the more I play the more I practice the luckier I, I become and this hunch proves to be correct. This Milsim is now drawing to a close and it uh, brings this gameplay to an end. Uh, but I just want to remind you before I go that there is a competition running. All you have to do is add up the number of times that you see cheating in this video and tally it up. Leave your answer in the comment section below and if it matches the number of times that I notice cheating, uh, you'll go in a hat and I will draw the winner and you'll receive a ghillie suit and crafting materials donated by Skirm Shop in Holland. Thanks very much for watching guys and I will see you next time.